Hi, I thought I'd just do a brief video in response to a couple of videos that uh, Fran Blanche from FranLab has made around a, an analog frequency counter. Uh, I'll link to those videos in the description. If you uh, haven't come across FranLab uh, and you're interested in uh, vintage electronics, in particular displays, that kind of thing um, I suggest you check it out there's some really great content on it so Fran uh, did a couple of videos as I said on this interesting frequency counter that had a number of tuned tines with an electromagnetic coil around the base of the tines and it's used to measure mains electricity frequency uh, by the resonance frequency of the tine uh, indicating the frequency at multiple times showing a frequency changing by one Hertz I think it was per time uh, so you can uh, measure uh, the frequency of the mains electricity so this is a very similar device um, it's a from tachometer it's different application there's no coil in this it's not for measuring mains electricity frequency it's for measuring uh, engine RPM so it's just like Fran's device in that it's got a row of tines, or in fact two rows of tuned tines, but it's designed for bolting onto things like engines and the tines vibrating at their harmonic resonant frequency um, to indicate approximate engine revs. So the scale going from four to eight is eight is thousand RPM. So four is 4,000 RPM. I think the idea is that you'd put it on something like, say you had a lawnmower and you were calibrating the carburetor to um, set the idle speed, say, for example. You could just place this onto your lawnmower and by which time is vibrating, know what speed the engine's running at. So I think I saw these on, I think it was AVE's channel a couple year or so ago. He had one of these. Um, and I found a cheap one on eBay and it's just stayed in my man cave as a bit of a curiosity ever since. It's just taped onto the top of a subwoofer. It's a really beefy subwoofer. It's a uh, BK Electronics Monolith Plus, I think it is. It's got a 500 watt RMS Class D amp and uh, it puts out a lot of sound. Uh, great company, BK Electronics, by the way. They're a British company that... I think most of their business is sound systems for cinemas, but they also have a little sideline selling um, subwoofers and amplifiers direct to the public. And they're great value for money, really nicely made uh, bits of kit. Anyway, so plugged into the uh, subwoofer is a mobile phone with a frequency generator on it. And so thinking about the conversion of RPM to Hertz frequency, um, obviously just divide by 60 because revolutions per minute versus oscillations per second, you just divide by 60. So um, 6,000 RPM as indicated on the top row of times on the far right uh, will be 100 Hertz. 4,000 is about 67 Hertz. So if I turn the amplifier on or rather unmute it, that nice I'm not sure how clearly you're gonna be able to hear me it's quite loud bass but what I'll do is I'll just walk up the frequencies and you can see as, as each different time starts to vibrate
phone's decided to reboot itself anyway you get the idea interesting little device from the past and as I said very similar to um, Fran's frequency counter just with the emission of the coil anyway hope you enjoyed that <laughs>